Hi guys, it is 9.30 in the morning and we've just got out the car and we're on our way to an event this morning. Um, it's an intimate masterclass with Valentine Warner. I'm pretty excited, don't know really what's in store for today. But I'm excited and I'm gonna bring you along the way. And I'm here with Matt, he's come along. Yay! So we have been taught how to make three awesome recipes and now it's our turn. We're going to be making this awesome custard. I think we did. First we're going to start by beating two eggs. Let's go. Just crack it in. Don't get any shadow left. Awesome. It wants to be really well integrated, but it doesn't want to be overly airy. Okay. Can you get this one? That was awesome. I wasn't able to film too much while I was in there, so just gonna have a little explain now. So we were in there, it was like only seven of us. I didn't know what to expect at all. And it was a masterclass with um, Valentine Warner and he was showing us three awesome Japanese inspired recipes which he is going to be giving us the recipe so maybe I could do them on my channel or on my Facebook page um, but it was so cool he showed us how to make that we just got to ask loads of questions if we needed to and then afterwards we got to make um, one of the recipes so me and Matt chose to make the crab custard which sounds not very nice I'm not gonna lie I, when he said it I was a bit like oh I wonder what that would taste like because I've never had that before but it was delicious there were three really easy recipes I think he's trying to get more you know Japanese inspired recipes here and to show that you know they are easy to make at home and they're incredible and I'll definitely be making them at home um, but it was really cool because it was at Panasonic headquarters and um, they were showing us some products there they showed us a juicer which was amazing it was a slow juicer it also showed us a steam oven which was really cool and I also thought that was really cool because steam ovens are meant to be really good to bake with get really nice moist sponges they said I might be able to get one home to practice with so that would be awesome if they can you know lend me one um, and then I could do a video about um, you know a recipe or something so that was really cool I had such a great time um, and it was just I've never done anything like that before like a private masterclass I thought it was great and I think I'm gonna look into going to some more classes like that, that'd be awesome. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video um, and I'll have photos up on my Instagram, so go check those out. Let me know if you enjoy these vlogs and you'd like to see some more. Thanks guys.